Happy Sunday, everybody. We're here at the DeLorean Motor Company of Florida because today is their grand opening. I hope we get to see a whole bunch of DeLoreans today. I see one. I know, there's one right in front of us right now. There it is. There's a DeLorean right here. It's a brand new DeLorean. Look at that little tiny window. It's a little baby window. Yeah, pretty fancy looking. And there's this little kid right here. He's a little Marty McFly. He's a little tiny Marty McFly wearing his Back <laughs> to the Future hat. Because it's the grand opening, they've got like a little spread out here. And then they've got a DeLorean just like wide open right here. Look at that. Brand new stamped stainless steel. If you guys ever wanted to see the inside of a stock DeLorean, there it is. How cool is that? Where do you put your groceries? In that little net right there. Where, where do you put your baby? In the net. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I think all of these are just DeLoreans from the DeLorean Motor Club of Florida that they brought in here for this grand opening event. And they've got a time machine in here. Wow, look at that. Here's all the inside workings of it. So cool, and flux capacitor back there. How very cool is that? Here, I'm gonna give you guys a shot of this area right here, and I want you guys to tell me what film is this one from? One, two, or three? Custom built. Oh, look. It looks like a, a haze manual for the DeLorean time machine. I just looked over, and you're here, and you're just like taking apart I, the time I machine. To see where the plutonium goes. Jeez Louise, I don't think you're supposed to just open up a plutonium Sorry, container. I'm excited. <laughs> plutonium chamber. I feel like Adam knows entirely too much about Back to the Future. Yes, of course. November 5th, 1955. The detail on this car is amazing. I feel like we're just spending entirely too much time on this DeLorean. There's so many other DeLoreans, but man. Look, that's how you turn on the tunes. This DeLorean just got an award at the Celebration Car Show yesterday which is really impressive. Here's the garage portion of the DeLorean store. So in case you guys are wondering what this place is, mm -hmm. they're going to be servicing, selling, refurbishing, and selling new, actually, DeLoreans. Yeah. So you could come here and you could buy a used DeLorean or you can buy a new DeLorean. I know that sounds kind of strange, a new DeLorean. Basically, when DeLorean went out of business, they had a bunch of back stock of parts and somebody bought out all those parts. So now they can make brand new DeLoreans out of all of those old parts. Should we get a DeLorean? I kind of want to buy a DeLorean. <laughs> all right, Jen, I think the only thing we have to do is figure out which model we want. I want the Back to the Future model. Okay, that's this one. Okay, let's all do right. it. Wait, where's all the buttons? <laughs> all right, well, we got to put them in. <laughs> you guys remember when I had the Corvair and it had a rear engine? The DeLorean also has a rear engine. And there's the transmission. We're all the way underneath. Really getting in there. It looks like this one has already started to be refurbished because you can see got like a new fuel filter, new starter, stuff like that. New alternator. You can see they've got some of the stamped parts over here. Here's some rear fenders, front fender, a couple of windshields in here. Good news guys, found out that it does have air conditioning. I think this is interesting. There's, some of them have like a little panel here for you to fill up the gas tank and some of them don't have it, but the gas fill is still underneath the front hood here. So you can just barely see it underneath there yeah you can see with a little yellow tag there that says unleaded only so you have to open up the hood and then fill it with gas Good. so adam told us that this is an earlier one with the gas thing there and this one's later where you have to open up the hood but the hood opens this way you can see over here on the workbench it looks like they're doing some work on a water pump and the brakes and a radiator and they've got a whole tool cage over here full of parts so that they can fix your delorean for you what have we got here DeLorean, front brake and rear brake hoses. Ooh, I told Jen if they had shirts, I was gonna, oh! I told Jen if they had shirts, I was gonna buy them. The uh, Celebration Exotic Car Festival, yeah. this was a platinum winner, so this is, uh, this one's pretty much uh, the way it came from the factory. Right around the middle of the 81 run, they switched it over to a gray interior, just like oh. the Back to the Future cars, so oh, you can actually get them in gray also. Uh, this is a five-speed car. You have the option of a very interesting three-speed automatic. <laughs> Great little cars. You know, you're never going to win a speed race in them, but for when you start getting the areas that have little twisty hills and everything like that, it's a fun cruising car, and that's the great thing about it. I got to see how this works. Wow, it is down on the ground. Yeah. All right, I'm almost in. 
How comfy is it? It looks pretty comfortable. Actually, this is, this is pretty nice. Okay, I'm gonna get in now. You, you. I could do this. Yeah, let's get yeah. one. All right, we're gonna buy a DeLorean. We're officially in a DeLorean right now. This is so strange feeling. It's kind of really I, comfortable. I don't know if it would be, uh, if my head There's, would there's be. a little thing there. A little hole for your head to go. Yeah, you're pretty tall. Like, how? I'm pretty. At 6'4". You have 6'4"? Oh, he's, he's gonna close the door on her. Whoa, Whoa, look at that. You have a lot of room in there. I feel a little claustrophobic. Do you? Yeah, I do. It's pretty interesting. Who's sitting in the passenger? Gin Tracker! You're going back in time! <laughs> Gotta go back! I like the door open symbol. That's awesome. Just noticed that this one had its hood open so we could see inside at the engine. Holy cow. That looks awesome. It's a little V6. Holy cow, they, they have a whole bunch more out here. And it looks like this one has an aftermarket engine in it. Jeez, it's got a gigantic V8 in it. I like the customized LS1 DeLorean Motor Company head covers on it. It's a Corvette engine. That's intense. There's one that just showed up. He's just driving in right now. Just so many DeLoreans. Yeah. All right, I think we've seen all of the DeLoreans we can handle for one day. Did you see this whole line of DeLoreans behind us? This a lot awesome. of DeLoreans. I didn't know there were that many in the state. Yeah. I guess one well, guy- Well, there's a car show yesterday. Oh, that's why they're all here. Yeah, okay, celebration I know car show. One guy drove down from like Jersey Ooh. in his. Yeah. Pretty awesome. So, but the vlog's not over. We're gonna head over to, cause this is near the Florida mall. Yeah. And go over to the Florida mall, check out Joey Fatone's hot dog stand. Fat ones. Fat ones hot dogs. Let's go get a hot dog. That's the one with the V8 in it. I think he's really gonna like, he's really gonna like light it up here in just a second. <laughs> we came to help you guys push it back. Help them push it all the way back. Whew. Oh, I'm so tired now. <laughs> We're at the Florida Mall and it looks like a Shake Shack is coming here. And Jen said that Hot Topic closed. I wonder if they're gonna move it. Yeah, because that's kind of weird. They always have good Disney stuff in there. Yeah, but we're looking for Joey Fatone's hot dog stand. We made it to the food court. It took us a bit to find the place, but it's all the way down there by the entrance. Joey Fatone's hot dogs in Italian ice called Fat Ones. I'm excited. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna get the Boy Bander, and that's five different mini hot dogs that are all the different flavors that they offer. You got like a smorgasbord. This is called the Boy Bander. The Boy Bander. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a it's like a cornucopia of well, of hot dog goodness there. Which one is Joey Fatone? I don't know. Yeah, which one is Fatone? Is he the sloppy Joey? Yeah. I got the sloppy Joey. <laughs> the I see what they did there. Yeah. Sloppy yeah. Joe. Yeah. Joey Fatone, sloppy Joe. I see that. I just now got that. The Reuben? The that's sloppy the Joey. sloppy Joey. The I think I don't know what that is. I think that one might be the two New York because that's got sauerkraut on it. I think this is the hot dog. No, I think this is gone Hollywood. Gone Hollywood. And then the uh, Cuban. Just finished eating at Fat Ones. What do you think? It's kind of delicious. Yeah. Like I would eat this again. I I think for the price it was pretty okay. Um, I liked it. Yeah. It wasn't one of those things that I'm like I gotta go back. I gotta but, go back. But I, I liked it. And then there's this place we have to try sometime. What? What's it called? The bakery. I don't know. It was on some show that you guys were telling us to check out. So one time we'll have to come back and actually eat there. Yeah? We'll do it. One day we're going to have to come back and like just go to the Florida Mall because it's a good experience to see. Yeah, there's a lot of new stuff here. For sure. Goodness. A beef jerky store. Look at all of this beef jerky. Jen's in heaven right now. What are you eating? Okay, one of the samples you can get is a sample of worms. So yeah. I did, I got one. And let's taste it. The club is full of flowers and the pot is full of blood. Oh God, I don't want to. Was it, it good? It doesn't taste like anything. Yeah. It tastes like popcorn kernels. Yeah. I still think it's really interesting that there's a hotel in this mall. When I was at the DeLorean place, I bought a shirt I want to show it to you guys. Here's the front, and here's what's on the back. Pretty awesome. I like that it spells out like D E L O R, you know, DeLorean, in the the letters that are like a little bit different colored. How cool was that DeLorean place? I kind of want a DeLorean. Like I know that it's not economical or like the fastest car, 
or the like newest car, there's gonna be issues with it, but it's a cool car. Like there is no doubt about it that the DeLorean is a darn cool car. And then the Florida Mall where we went to go see uh, Fat Ones, Joey Fatone's hot dog restaurant. It was good, those hot dogs were good. I kinda wanna go back another day and try a different hot dog, although we did try a bunch of them. But now I'm like, you know, kinda worn out from DeLoreans and hot dogs, so I'm gonna go and I will see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.